Recently, we did a blog post on automating technical documentation updates with generative AI, where somebody had posted in the Write the Docs forum about the fact they were using Jira and wanted to know if there was a way of looking at the Jira commits and comparing it to their help center documentation and flagging up any sections that needed updating. And we created a proof of concept for this, which was based on updating a guide to London, changing the content when the weather changed. So it takes today's weather, it looks at the guide for being a, for things to see in London, and if the weather means that the advice on what to wear and what to see is wrong, it updates or makes recommendations on what to change. So the question was about tools like GitHub and Jira and GitLab and whether if you've got a repository with commits, whether you can use generative AI to make recommendations on where to change the documentation. So we've also done a proof of concept for that. We've used GitLab rather than GitHub mainly because the documentation's clearer and also it was easier to find an open source project to test this on. So this is a project, an open source project on GitLab called Mailman. We've created a fork of this. It has documentation and over time there have been a number of commits updating it. So what we want to do is see if we can check that the documentation is up to date. And so what we have done is we have created a GPTS that makes a query to the fork of the repository that we created, looks at the commits, compares it to the documentation and makes recommendations. Now at the moment this is looking at all of the commits and probably needs to be tweaked so it only looked at commits within a certain date range. But as a proof of concept, this is... And if you'd like more information on how to use generative AI in technical writing, then our course may be of interest to you cherryleaf.teachable.com We've already got the proof of concept about the weather in the course and we'll be updating the course to also include the proof of concept of the mailman example we've just developed. <laughs>